gonna be a little bit of a war, you know. My mother had her child. Yeah, she's a, she's like, I have a secret lover or something. Oh, yep, she's a fornicator. What the hell, mom? Okay. Has it revolted as well? Look at that. All of Illyricum basically revolted. As well as a lot of Central Italy. So let's uh, move this over here. Raise our whole army. Ooh, who's this? Eh, it's just sign this vassal. Okay, he's calling our ally. King of Poland. Got 15,000 troops, that's pretty damn good. Not bad at all. I need the men of Poland, please. Come as fast as you can. Protect Rome at all cost. Fire for a while. Look, okay, if they siege anything else than Italy, we'll let them do that. You know, I'll, I'll try to hammer in Italy as strong as I can. Back into the fold. Defend the capital, defend Rome. Should be able to win this. Uh, trusting. Content. Sinful to critics. Okay, let's not do that. Maybe fickle. It will be alright. Decent sized army up there. I want to fight them. Try and push them back as we can. Well, let's go fight. Okay, they, they don't want to help me fight. I don't know what they're doing. Okay. Where are my other good rulers? Generals. Are they all like revolting but still showing them? Zoom out. What? I know, I know, I know what's going on. They're going for my lands in Illyricum. That's alright. Oh, you want to see the whole war? Yeah. A little spicy war. I think we can handle it though. We got a strong ally in Poland. Poland is over here. They're pretty damn big, so. I think we got this. They are getting some decent war score from sieging down my stuff over here though. I don't know why, why they're getting that much war score, but I guess it is what it is. Let's go speed five again. Do they want to run into my army, maybe? That'd be nice. Otherwise, I'll fight them again. Okay. Another battle to win. I think they siege us down. Do we need to siege it back? Yeah. Okay. Uh, how's the siege going? The siege is won. There's an army running into me, that's okay. Who did I start as? I started as the Count of Cagliari in 867. I think he's like a dual count. And uh, went to the King of Sardinia, Sicily, and then we unified Italy recently. And now we're getting very close to forming Rome again. Hopefully on this character, we'll be able to... This character is live. Life. We'll uh, be able to unite Rome. Properly. We've got our own kind of Hellenic Christian mishmash faith working for us. So it's, uh, it's been a good time. A good time. We've been going hard. Stop sieging my stuff. Okay, we're heterosexual. I don't know how they get so much war score. I mean, they got like a ton of armies sieging down over there, but this land is not that valuable. 
Okay, that's a sin, so I don't really want that. I guess I'll be trusting. Does their army want to fight me yet? Oh, they have a big army. That's a pretty impressive army. I think we should actually like, form up and try to fight them wherever they land. Would be proper. If we could all go here and fight them. Before the disembark, disembark penalty goes away. That would be absolutely ideal. Hey, we're going to catch some of them. They're going to run in here. Poland's going to help. I think we're going to win. Okay, that's a big win for this war. A huge win. Oh man, all their forces went into this battle. That was great to crush them there. Really good. Ooh, okay. That was very important. Probably keep trying to chase down their army, maybe. Or we can just keep sieging. Eh, you know. Sure we can beat their army again. Well, it is kind of scary. Okay, they're sieging down Foggia. We'll siege down these two pieces of land, and then we'll try to clap it back at them. Need a new marshal. Let's go for the pickoff play. Please, Poland, get over here with your army. And let's go. Ooh, that's a big battle. Can we win? Oh, we're gonna lose. Ah, oh, they have so many knights. Look at that. Oh, vassal revolts. 70 to 15. Is it worth it to keep fighting or is it worth it to white peace? Hmm. Could just white peace, you know. You think white peace? Yeah. I mean, they have a lot of troops. Let's try it. Hopefully they just will uh, not be mad, you know? Can you guys just not be mad at me? Because we... <laughs> Our father died and we inherited this all this at five years of age, so... They were understandably a little mad, but... Now that we've been ruling for a little while, hopefully they'll warm up to me soon. Just please, I promise when I'm an adult, I'll be a really good ruler. Believe in me, vassals. Also, my guardian died at some point, I didn't realize that. Gosh, do I have to keep sending myself to university? I don't even know. I'm going to not do it, because I've already done it twice. She knows. Alright, so white peace. I do love presenting my vassals after wars. Wow, I literally got three traits from all the same, like, thing, I think. All the same event line. Kind of annoying. I want some different traits. I want some virtuous traits to get some piety. Yes, it is what it is. Right, so we're back to speed fiving. Keep improving our realm. And hopefully the uh, vassals will behave properly. Wouldn't that be something? That'd be something insane. Wow, 24 stewardship steward. Very nice. What's the development in Rome looking like now? 82. Man, it just keeps Thank going you, up. Sir. Oh, a small demo. Thank you very much for the follow. Your spymaster Duke Gaia has insulted me gravely. Sorry, who are you? Oh, you're that guy who borders me? Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna laugh in your face. Get out of town. Don't ever come back to Rome and talk to me Thank about you, this. Oh, wow. Arian. Level 5. Thank you, too. Jeez. Two in a row with that. Y'all are awesome. Just like how awesome Rome is going to be. All of you are welcome to join in the glory of Rome. That will soon be acquired. The main thing is we need to get to... We need to still conquer Thessalonica. That's the last piece of land we need. And then we can go for... We need to go for a living legend of fame. So, <laughs> you brought him here? Oh, jeez. 
And you are doubly awesome. Thank you very much. Byzantines still hold Thessalonica. They have no troops. That is very funny. Uh, once we're an adult, we'll probably just immediately go to war Thessalonica, clean that up. And then it's about getting prestige as fast as we can. We can do it now, actually. We can just do this now, right? Conquer the duchy. A Thessalonica. Yeah. We'll just do it now. Time is right. Let's just move a random rally point. I said move. Uh, I started in 867, I believe. Well, I don't believe it. I did start in 867, so. That is how we started. All the uh, VODs for this playthrough and episodes cut up are on my YouTube as well. In case you are curious about what else happened. Of course, I'm going to run this channel as well. Oh yeah, it's been a long game. And, uh... Quite the adventure, starting from a county to being close close to being Roman Emperor, so... It's been, it's been an action-packed a lot, to be honest. There's been a lot of drama at some points. Thankfully, though, our realm never got, like, completely split in half or fractured or stuff like that. Like, we got absolutely crushed by vassal revolts or anything. We were able to manage our vassal revolts decently, so... That's what's kept us alive. Hmm. Prison these people. Yeah, this is probably the hardest achievement I've gone for. The other one is, uh... Mother of Us All is the other hard, really hard achievement in this game. And, uh, I'll soon hopefully have both those achievements under my belt. Unfortunately, Mother of Us All, not technically, because... I kind of got tired trying to convert every little bit of land. I kind of quit that one. But I did conquer all of Africa. And unite Africa. Look at this. Paradox Octavia, you're a woman now. We became an insightful thinker. It is tier 4. That's nice. Let's go straight for the piety path, I believe. Be good. Theology focus. Because we could also possibly mend the schism before we're done. That'd be fun. Let's win this war and then we'll start feasting and hunting and going on pilgrimages. Get all the stats we need. Where am I? Okay, for some reason, like, my mana arms did not get raised at all. Why did that happen? Where are my mana arms? Are they raised somewhere? Oh, what the? When, when did I do this? <laughs> when did I raise my mana arms over there? Oh, I think when I, mo when I was moving the rally point, I accidentally pressed to raise all mana arms there. And it was in Napoli before, so... Yeah, that's what happened. Oh, speaking of men arms, I just got legionaries unlocked, which is a special men arms unit available to Romans. I believe so. I should actually look at that. How good are legionaries? Uh, called Palatani. Palatini. How are they good? How good are they compared to armored footmen? Wow, they are straight up way better than armored footmen. They are more expensive, but yeah, we'll get some armor, some of those very soon. After this war is done, we'll recruit a full legion. Need a legion to spread the glory of Rome to all the barbarian masses, you know? We just gotta do it. It's gotta be done. I'm here to fix the world. Also, we're actually losing this war because it's taking so long to get these war goals sieged down. We're not being sieged ourselves or anything by Byzantium. No, because they are pitifully weak. They have 560 troups to their name. How the money have fallen. The money have fallen. For those that are new here, we used to be a vassal of Byzantium. And I was Byzantine Emperor via claiming the throne at one point. Uh, unfortunately, being a Roman over a bunch of Greeks ruling, turns out they did not like me at all. So I went to plan B, which was unify Italy by myself. And that turned out very good for us. Oh, I'm pregnant. That's right. Got married to that Polish gentleman. That alliance, and now we're going to have our first child. Very good. Might as well keep on sieging down the rest of this stuff that Byzantium owns. Their little piddly scrap that they have left. 
Let me check something real quick. We're getting very close to 50 followers, everybody. Soon. Soon to being an affiliate. That would be awesome. Uh, my husband does not like somebody. This is like my mentor. Okay, that's a, that's a bit of an overreaction. Come on. I think I'll just send my mentor away. Placidia, okay. A daughter for us? How's this war not one yet? I feel like we're kind of like ruining them. Somehow it's just not panning out quite right. Ooh, just a waiting game. Oh, pregnant again. Wow. That was, uh, that was a quick one. Come on, 88%. Got the war goal. Yes. Last pieces of land we need. Last pieces. Uh, grant to, I don't know, my cousin? Sure. Okay. Oh gosh, revolt. This guy wants the Empire of Italia again. Or no, it's a different claimant now. Can I murder this person? Possibly. I have tons of money. Can they not threaten my rule? That would be nice. Okay. And what about you? Okay, let's uh, let's eliminate people who are possibly wanting to over for us. I'd say that's a pretty good idea. Thankfully, they're still pretty weak. Should be getting like long rain penalty soon. Building up. Another daughter, Paula. Messenger Pigeon. Uh, I think that's unnecessary. We got a really high chance of success. Okay, so now if we look at Restore Roman Empire, completely control all the land we need. Now we just need to become a living legend. Ooh. Antioch. I don't control Antioch. Oh, this guy's Catholic. What the hell? You need to be converted. Now we're good. Okay. Uh, I guess we could... Waging War will give us prestige. So we're hosting, in, hosting feasts and hunts. So let's do that immediately. Let's get on that train right away. Gosh, we're losing time. In our scheme. Gosh dang it. What a man. Come on. I want to murder this lady. No one can stand against my rightful rule to the throne. To the seat of Rome. Oh, I don't need to control this uh, temple. Well, I kind of like absentmindedly clicked that too fast accidentally. I didn't mean to press it, but thankfully I pressed the right option there. I did not give in to the peasants. So let's take him out. Oh, okay. I only had to fight one of their armies. Not even both of them. Interesting. I think we need to convert Faith around here. The issue. Thank you, sir. Apparently the peasants don't like uh, the diversity of Faith going on. So, join my Christian Hellenicism. Thank you, Shadowstorm. For the follow. Thank you very much. Uh, hmm. What is this? My paradox, you are currently in possession of something, some place that should be mine. County of Tavoli. Dude, it belongs to me. That's, that's, that's like been my counties for... I've owned that for centuries at this point. What do you mean you own it? Crazy. He's crazy. I don't know what this guy's talking about. Get him out of my face. Meanwhile, let's keep feasting. Alright. One more prestige level to our living legend. How goes, how goes the CK? Splendidly, at this point. Had a little bit of peasant revolts, but we've conquered all the land we need. Restore Rome. We just need to get another prestige level. And then we're good to go, because this, uh, this is what we're going for. The achievement for uh, the achievement to unite Rome. The Zyron Man, and we are almost there. Almost there. And I'd like to mend the Great Schism just for fun, too. If we do that as a bonus, that'd be nice as well. Pregnant again? 
Ooh, okay, let's get this claimant out of here. Bon appetit, Aurelia. My agents have prepared for weeks. The cook has been bribed to look the other way. The poison has been acquired. And the duck was gifted Camista Aurelia alone. It'll be rid of the poison. The better herbs will mask the smell as it is served. Uh, upgrade a temple? Sure. Doesn't bother me to upgrade a temple. Hey, that faction targeting me has disbanded. I wonder why. Maybe the claimant got murdered. Mysteriously somehow. And nobody knows who did it. So sad. That's just so sad when you hear about stuff like that. Murders. I'm right. Let's go to Jerusalem. This is our first time visiting Jerusalem as we, what, when we own it, so. It's nice and, you know, safe in Jerusalem. There's going to be our favorite, you know, kind of like drinks and foods around, I'm sure. Uh, yeah, go for the piety. We're going to need a lot more piety if we're going to mend the schism. Ooh, do I want to fight? Yeah, I'll try and fight. Well, it worked. I became an aspiring blade master. Nice. And we had another daughter. Oh, gosh. The, uh... Dynastic preference for having daughters is coming back, it seems. We had like one generation there, we had a decent amount of sons, but now we're back to having only daughters. Fortunately, that's been uh, afflicting us quite a bit. But now we have a equal uh, preference religion, so it's no longer a penalty opinion, at least. Yeah, the curse skipped a generation. That's exactly what happened. Uh, should we divine the stars? Does that cost piety to do? Maybe not. Let's try it out. Dedicated worker. Stewardship. Oh, please, stewardship. Lifestyle experience. Okay. That doesn't really help us, unfortunately. Uh, keep upgrading stuff. Oh, yeah, that's right. I was going to get my legionaries. Ooh, we don't actually have to get rid of our armored footman. We can just get uh new. A new... Regiment. We have room now. The Palatini. The best of the best. Palatini are elite Roman soldiers who serve the Emperor directly. They have ooh, 40 more damage than a heavy than heavy infantry. Or than armored footmen rather. They have nine more armor than armored footmen. And they have 20 screen where armored footmen have zero. And the size is exactly the same. So basically they're amazing. Got a lot of these. Let's go for like 10. Go for 10 for now. <laughs> Sounds like a good number to me. Basically, nobody's gonna stand up against our army now. Which is nice. But it was also basically true anyway before we even got those guys. As it turns out, we're kind of powerful. More feasting? I mean, it's chances to get prestige, so I'll keep going, but damn. A lot of, a lot of feasts. Surprised everybody in my realm, my realm is not a beast. Uh, it's mildly surprising at this point. I have become a year reveler. Very nice. Uh, what can we upgrade in Veneto? More money. Why not? What can go wrong with that? Just more money. And how do we not have a max level trade port in Genoa, of all places? Let's go. And I'm pregnant again. Oh, gosh. Somebody found out that was a, I'm a killer. Damn it. Damn you. The Countess of Venice was damn Venetians. Even though she's not a Venetian, apparently. She's actually French. And also, she's not my fave. How dare you? Please. Join our new, brand new movement. The Christian Hellenic faith. It's wonderful, trust me, you'll love it. Reconquesting anytime you want. It's just beautiful. It's a beautiful faith, I promise. You'll love it. Join in on the fun. Wow, I like how both my grandparents are still living, but it's only on my uh, mother's side. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Hey, Balton is still independent. I remember we were allies with these guys for a while. Hmm. Use my voice. I need a drink.
All right, better now. Oh, feast in Constantinople. We're just seeing all the hot spots, aren't we? Hey, I finally had a son, Trajan. That's a decent name, I suppose. Oh, he's sickly though. No, my one and only son I had is sickly, of course. TK wouldn't have it any other way. As it so happens. Ooh. Is it just me or does this lady look jacked in that picture? Okay, it's just me. She only has 10 prowess. I thought she was buff or something. Alright. So we have quite a while to go to when we progress towards the living legend. Honestly, we need to to have these on notify when this decision is available. And I think I really do need to take the rest to go hunting, because I want those hunting trophies. Because that is prestige per month, right? And not much, but something. I think we should go to war in the meantime to get prestige. Uh, Could we declare war for like a kingdom? We have truth, so we need to find a good kingdom to go to war for. Anatolia, kind of splintered. Nikaia, go to war for Nikaia, maybe. Or all of Bulgaria. do have some pretty beefy allies. Basically only West Francia, but they're still pretty beefy. Oh gosh. Power house in my house is just flickering right now. What the fuck? Thankfully my computer didn't go off. Holy hell. Okay, I'm back. Uh, as it turns out, there's a huge storm going on outside. Uh, I live in my basement just dream, so... Yeah, I didn't notice there was a huge storm going on outside, so that's happening right now. There's some serious wind and rain going on. Uh, hopefully it does not cut the stream. Fingers crossed, and uh, hopefully we'll be all right. But uh, nobody was doing anything, so it's just uh, just the weather outside being crazy right now. All right, so what we're doing, thinking about going to a Kingdom Conquest War. Kind of sucks that France is an ally. But maybe a well-placed murder scheme could break them up, possibly. Uh, da, da, da. Wait, who is this? Somehow we're we have somebody of the of our dynasty that's married to the next ruler of Bulgaria. That's interesting. Ooh, maybe we murder this guy's wife. Hmm. I believe that is the issue. Let's try that out. Okay. If we can do that, we can definitely go to war for Bulgaria. Just to get some more prestige by winning it. Speed up this process of getting the prestige we need. How's the rest of the world going? We haven't uh, taken a big widescreen look recently. Ooh, not feeling well. Let's go for that. Okay, uh, Mongolia's a thing. The rest of the world is looking pretty normal, though. Kong is pretty powerful. You go, Kong. Oh, look how prestigious they are, too. Damn. And Wales is taking over England. Would you look at that? The Welsh Revenge. Oh, uh, you have to feast. Ooh, existence of the scheme got exposed. That's unfortunate. Still 90% chance to fire successfully, so... Let's just hope that goes well. Oh gosh, smallpox. Oh no. Get a position in here right away. Agrippina. Okay, 18 learning is going all right, I guess. Cask of wine. Catrian will attend a local celebration in Roma, ooh, in our hometown. And I happen to know that she's a bit of a wine aficionado. I could lure her into the cellar of my castle for an exclusive tasting and to make sure that she never walks out again. 
ho, 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 ho. Classic cask of Amatado or whatever it's called. Yeah, this is that one story. I don't know. I read it once in high school. Uh, do I want to be a herbalist? Sure. It doesn't hurt. It gives us some health protection. Disease resistance, medium boost, and four stats. As a bonus. That's good. 